Welcome into Cronkite Sports Live. For those of you who turned into our football special last week, thank you. But this now is our first official episode of the season. And my name is Jacob Rudner, joined here by Matt Venezia. And Matt, it's a pleasure to have you here on the desk. How you doing? Jacob, very excited to be here. We're not going to waste any time, and we're going to get right into the action with ASU Soccer taking on Nebraska out in Tucson. Only seven minutes in, Nicole Douglas found the back of the net for the Sun Devils, wasting little time putting ASU on top early one to nothing. The Cornhuskers trying to get it right back early. Florence Brazil putting it over the top of the cage. To the 53rd minute, this corner kick by the Sun Devils nearly found the back of the net. A lot of commotion out in front. The contest remained one to nothing. Nicole Douglas already has one on the day, looking for the second. She put it over the net. Goaltender Berta Goodlogs locked it down for the Sun Devils as she had a fantastic outing down the stretch for ASU, keeping the shutout and bouncing back from a rough performance against LSU. This was her second shutout of the year, following her first of the year at Mississippi State. Here's what Coach Graham Winkworth had to say after the Sun Devils got the win in Tucson, one to nothing. That was Jonah Krell taking us inside the vault. Now the Sun Devils held the Southern Utah Thunderbirds to 14 points in the season opener last week. WCSN football reporter Cameron Miner has an in-depth breakdown of the Sun Devils' defensive performance from last week. That was WCSN football reporter Cameron Miner with an in-depth breakdown of the Sun Devil defense. Now staying with football, the Arizona State football team will be debuting these sweet two-tone maroon and gold helmets this Saturday night against UNLV. Sun Devil Nation saw a sneak peek of them on social media yesterday. The two-tone look shows off the team's colors while also mirroring the gorgeous Arizona sunset. ASU equipment manager Jerry Naley stated that the Sun Devils will wear the helmets multiple times this upcoming season. Number two, we got more football. Jaden Daniels airing it out to Andre Johnson, a 31-yard connection in the contest. That actually went on to be Pac-12 catch of the week. So the Sun Devils getting a lot of love. Let's see it one more time. A great catch from the 6'3 wide receiver for the Sun Devils. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching our first official episode of the season for Cronkite Sports Live. For Matt Venezia, for everybody in the studio, my name's Jacob Rudner. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you next week.